<laughs> yes, I've done it. After years and years, I've done it. I've done it. I've created the button I can grant you any wish. I really need to come up with a better name for this thing. But I guess the button that gives you any wish will have to do. Anyways, I must... I need to find two people that are willing to test this. Aha! Gumball and Darwin. They're foolish. They're young. They could obviously fall for such, such an easily marvelous attraction. I'm going to go to them right away. Ugh, Darwin, do you have to leave your dirty la laundry over here? Yes, I do, Gumball. And there's nothing you can do about it. Hmm. Desmond Dennis references. So cheesy. I wish something would happen, you know? Yeah, I feel you, man. I feel ya. <gasps> Guys, I have something to show you. <sighs> what is it, nerdy guy? And how'd you get in our house? Your mom let me in. She knows me really well. Don't speak about her mom that way. Okay, okay, okay. Listen, I made this invention that grants you any wish. That looks like a badminton shuttle. Shut up, it's not. Anyways, uh, who would like to try it first? I mean, I don't mind in giving it a crack. Sure thing, just good. Uh, Say what you want, and press the button, and it'll grant you any wish. Uh, hmm. I wish... I wish... Uh, what do I wish for? Aha! I wish a Jason Dorito video got more than a thousand views. Ha! Ba, ba, da, 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 da. Oh my god, 3.2k views. Honestly, you guys are awesome. I just want to say thank you for getting this YouTube video to get more than 3,000 views. And, you know, you're, you're just uh, amazing people. Just to thank you. For, you, this, you didn't have to do this, but thank you. Thank you so much. You're awesome. Peace. Ugh. Uh, oh my god, that, that amount of crazy support is amazing. I can't wait to see what content they'll make in the future. They? Jason Rudeau's literally just us, but in animation form in British. Yeah, true. Still, uh, that's awesome, nerdy guy. What else can you do? Anything you like. How about you, Darwin? Why don't you give it a spin? Uh, I don't know. You know what? Fine. I guess I'll give it a try. You know, for the children's funds and all that. Yeah. Uh, I wish... Hmm. I wish a world peace was a thing. Ha! Gumball, have I ever told you I love you? Boo! I'm sorry. What? Yeah, I mean, you're amazing and you mean the world to me. Did anyone ever tell you that Pride Month's over? I, I know, it's, it's a little bit too late. But we can have a hug. I wish Rob was a villain again. Shh. Ha! <laughs> Screw you, you little da 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 pig! Ha <laughs> ha! You did mukbangs for a living. You can't talk. I know. <laughs> Gumball, why would you do that? Well, I didn't want him going up to my bedroom and be like, "Ooh, do you want to skip Count Daisies together?" <laughs> no, I got, we gotta have some edginess in the show, you know. Our show's not that edgy, or at least it's not supposed to be. But I guess the the coast of has been put. The content we've been posting in November had been quite edgy since with all the lore and all that. But that's behind us now. Oh my god. I just imagine how much we'd make if we sell this. I'm sorry, but this item is not for sale, alright guys? You guys need to learn a little decency. It's not just thinking about the money. Listen bro, if you don't want to end up on the streets, there's something you guys sell. I mean, like, how did you even, like, this isn't even possible. How did you do that? Oh yeah, my ways. <laughs> Okay, nerdy guy. Well, since you since you were the inventor, do you want to have a crack? Uh, I mean, Thor, I guess. Ah! <laughs> Ooh. Ah! What, what, nerdy guy, what kind of wish is that? Sorry, I wish I would be in Anais' bedroom. Oh, Anais. I think about it all the time, you know. I just didn't have the, you know, the right words to express how much I love her. Wait, didn't you date Carrie? Yeah, but we broke up after you two were kissing. That was an act for a play, you know? I'm still broken up with Carrie. Sorry, I guess I was just quick to assume. But still, I don't really care about Carrie. She's not my type. I, like, there's something else I'd like. The screaming kids outside to stop? No, there's more. She's just got that roundy edge of personality. I mean, we're literally made for each other. Eh, 
This is as corny as a cork I can. For the kids outside that won't stop screaming. But, you know, it's like... It's, it's, it's like... It's, it's like a monsoon of love and romance in the air. I, I don't know what I'll do without her. Uh, there's a light to do. I get those shits to stop. It's really messing up my scene. Uh, well, I, I don't know. Well, maybe I could ask the man that does give good advice. Oh, I know the man. Hector. Yo, come over here. Sure. Can stop making all that racket! Yeah. Are you the three that try to summon? Stop using Mr. Small's cat phrase, all right? Sorry, I, I, I guess I won't do that. But uh, what brings you here today? Uh, hello there. I'm nerdy guy. You probably don't know me because I was a pretty new student back in the day, and still I don't even know my whole class's name. Well, I don't know because we've had our fair share of adventures over the years. But I, I'm pretty new here, so I don't really know. Okay, uh, hello, nerdy guy, I'm Hector. Listen, do you need help or something? Yes, 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 I do need help. Yes, I do need help. Yes, I do need help. Fine, what do you need help with? I need to get a girl mind. Okay, uh, I don't really know much about girls. I mean, the last girl I had, she broke up with me because she thought I was too fat. Well... She wouldn't be wrong. What was that? Uh, nothing, nothing, nothing. You know, I could step on you in a matter of minutes, right? No, I know that. I know, know that. <gasps> I just realized something. I could just use my invention to make her fall in love with me. Uh, don't think that's a good idea, dude. Yeah, I mean, you never know. Like, you could, uh, it could backfire in dangerous ways. No, guys. I'm pretty sure it'll work. I'm pretty sure. In fact, I'm going to go up to her right now and be the confidence man I can be. I think you mean confident, but okay. Come on, Darwin. Okay. Thanks for your voice, Hector. No problem. Hopefully one day, y'all can relate. <laughs> I wish Anais was in love with me. Hello there. I love nerdy guy. <laughs> Why do you sound different? I love nerdy guy. Why do you sound different? I love Nerdy Guy! I love Nerdy Guy! I love to destroy Nerdy Guy! I'm sorry. What? Did you just say you wanted to destroy me? Or is that just another weird glitch? Because I'm pretty good when it comes to fiction glitches. Trust me. I am pro. No, I said I just wanted to jail. Wait, what? That's the thing, your age is what they're driving me insane. I'll hit you in the face just for crying on a plane. Ooh, nerdy guy, are you alright? Uh, I think you accidentally said alternate Anais instead of normal Anais. Uh, but I said Anais. Yeah, but surely her legal name was Anais. But we just called her old and Anais as a nickname. Oh, when I when I'm in the win, I'm all it's always me in the losing spot. But... What? You know what I mean? Okay. Listen, nerdy guy. Uh, you uh, you could just go up to her and ask her like a normal man. I mean, look at me and Darwin. We both got girlfriends. Um. Oh, yeah. We, Darwin had a few troubles in the past, but we don't speak of that, right, buddy Darwin? Yeah, we don't speak of that. But hey, I'm getting better. Uh, I mean, hey, do the time we kiss her in place, right? That's even harder than Will Smith slap. Oh! Oh my god. Are you okay? I mean, you know, he could just talk to us if anything's wrong, right? Yeah, but then again, it would be harder to do than a, than a, than a, than a, than a. Yeah, like, then it's like, uh, that makes no sense. Listen, guys, I don't think I'll be able to impress Anais, even if I did have the slick hair or the slick body. It's just anything. Well, you could always give her this uh, love injection thing I saw on the internet. What? Uh, how does that work? 
Well, there was like some love injection thing I saw on eBay. I bought it and I put it on Penny and then she, I was the first thing she saw and then she fell in love with me. Yeah, and she's still crazy about me even to this day. Like she won't stop knocking on my door. It's uh, it's pretty weird, but you gotta deal with that on a daily basis. Think it'll work? Yeah, it'll work. Now if you'll excuse me, we gotta run away from Penny. Ah! Ah! Oh my god, oh my god, oh my god, oh my god!